what you need now is a measuring tape, um, some wallpaper, possibly any other paper that you can actually keep, fold and won't easily rip. I'm using wallpaper because I've loads there. A scissors, a pen and then the measurements that you've taken all ready to use. So the length on here was 37 inches. What I've already done is measured 38 inch of wallpaper in length and I've cut it out. It will, if it's been rolled, it will just keep falling backwards. So turn it backwards, uh, roll it like this and it should just sit straight for you. You won't have any problems, it won't keep curling. Now we're going to start marking um, measurements taken from this board onto our wallpaper. Now what we're going to do is pretend that it is halved. So you're going to use half of these measurements now. So for instance, now your shoulders are 14 inch. We've said halved it and said it's seven inch now. So from this top right hand side corner, you're going to measure seven inches this way and mark it there. Second thing we need to mark now is this area here that's below chest. So we've halved it already, which is six inch and three quarter and it comes down five inches. So six and three quarters this way and five inches down. So we need to go six and three quarters this way and five inches down and mark there. Third measurement we need is the half measurement from the chest area, which is 10 inches and coming down from the shoulder to there is eight inch. So from shoulder down eight inches and across 10 inch and just mark it there. Next one is the waist which is nine and a quarter inches because we've halved that again. And from shoulder down is 13 and a half. So let's go nine and a quarter inches this way. And from the top down, it's gotta be 13 and a half inches and mark it down. Now let's do the hip. So half the measurement for the hip is 10 and a half inch and from the top down it's 19 and a half so we're going to do 10 and a half this way and it's got to be 19 and a half this way so mark it there right. so last one for now is the width of the kameez and half of the measurement is 11 inch so all you need to do is mark it at 11 inch from the end over here, right at the bottom. So it's 11 inches from here. So from this end to there and mark it as 